Hey everyone, this is me, Sadia here, and I'm back with the first week of uh, October read stuff from the 1st through the 7th of October 2023. This reading is going to be for the sign of Aries. So Aries, let's see what's coming in for you for this uh, week time. I will be adding a lot many cards here in this reading, so stay tuned. And before I dive into the read, let me remind you, it's a general reading. Hitman is not resonate with everyone out there. Pick whatever resonates and leave the rest. For person reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also check out other services that I offer as well in the description box. So let's see what's coming in for you for this week time. Wow. Aries, I really feel like, you know, right now, um, you're keeping yourself very positive. Very, 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 very positive. And if you are not, trust me, something is going to happen in this week time, which is going to make you look at your love life situation from a positive perspective, whether you see things happening or not. But there will be some sort of an uplifted energy that you're going to feel all around you and within you as well, which is going to make you feel like probably, you know, the things that you desire in love will work out. You will have some sort of support coming up for you as well in regards to whatever you desire in your love coming from the people around you. Um, if there has been a situation where you felt that, um, you know, um, somebody was not looking at you from a positive perspective, be that your specific someone or their family, I really feel like, you know, they are going to start looking at you from a beautiful perspective where they would wish to take things forward with you and prioritizing you as well. Right now, maybe you don't see it coming, but it is going to happen. Let's keep shuffling. Let's see what's coming in for you during this week time, babies. What's coming in for you? Ten of Swords. I feel like, you know, for the majority of you, you feel hurt because you feel like, you know, you're betrayed by someone. You demand justice right now. Um, maybe a situation between you and your, uh, your specific someone ended. Maybe your connection ended with your specific someone. Maybe they felt like, you know, we cannot make it happen. Or maybe you chose to put an end to that connection because your person was not prioritizing you or choosing you over their family and all those issues. Now, I really feel like, you know, whatever has ended between you and a specific someone, the justice will be coming in. You don't have to stress around it because there is success coming for you. So whatever it is or whoever it is that you're dealing with, I really feel like, you know, the divine really want you to know one thing that this person, whoever has ignored you, neglected you, chose not you, but somebody else over you, this person is going to come back to you. They are going to get stressed out. They are going to feel like, no, they need you. They want you. They, they have feelings for you. I feel like you know, for a majority of you, this person doesn't feel that way right now towards you. They feel like, oh, maybe we are attached or maybe we have a sexual connection or maybe we have attraction, but it's not love for sure. So if that's their perspective of seeing you or looking at you or the connection that they have with you, it is going to change. I really feel like, you know, your person is going to be thinking about you, feeling about you differently. Their emotions are going to get attached to you. They are going to get attached to you emotionally, which probably has been missing here. So I really feel like, you know, a shift has come uh, through for you during this week time and will be coming for you during this week time where you will see your person wanting you after a period of like, you know, them ignoring you or neglecting you or choosing other people over you. I really feel like, you know, they are also coming as somebody who's addicted or who's very strongly attached to you, attracted to you during this week time. Um, for majority of you, really don't think it's going to happen. Uh, but at the same time, probably it's, it's more like, you know, the feeling where you give up on something and you feel like it's never going to work out. So you stop worrying around it. You stop getting bothered around it. I feel like you know, for a majority of you, you are becoming positive about your love life because you feel like what worse can happen from now onwards. So you are kind of like, you know, having no expectations, probably which is the reason why this person coming and approaching you with a beautiful offer is going to be so um, unexpected towards, you know, for you. As this person approaches towards you or reaches to you, this person is going to be like um, completely different them because they were very non-committal. They were very unexpressive. They were very um, maybe sexually active with you, but emotionally they have always had their guards up. So I really feel like you know this person is somehow is going to open up about their feelings to you during this week time for sure. Let's see more cards here. And I really feel like you, know, you will have the people in your life who you need the support from. 
so if their family was not approving of you if their family was the reason they are gonna come with the support of them and uh, they are gonna make things happen for some of you there will be some sort of a contract coming in between you and this person as well uh, there is a magician and mirror card for majority of you, you just know one thing the divine support is with you so make sure that you're always thinking the right thoughts thoughts that are in alignment with what you truly desire not against that um i feel like you know if if you believe that getting rid of this person and even thinking about is uh, about the situation with them is going to help you manifest what you want go ahead do that but if and when you choose to think about them don't think about oh, it's over, oh, it's this, oh, it's that. Think of what you desire and then surrender. You know, just, just don't think at all about this person and allow the divine to bring this person back in your life with something to offer. I feel like, you know, for majority of you, the moment you let go of the stress is the moment when this person starts thinking about you. So for some of you, I really feel like, you know, this person is uh, thinking about you because probably you have stopped thinking about this person heavily and dominantly. Let's see what else is coming in for you during this week time. Okay, we do have the emperor coming in. I really feel like, you know, somebody's going to take action. You know, they, they might have been invested in other things, other situations they are choosing you now. Uh, this person is going to be like open uh, completely to, to have a conversation, to have a communication, to have a uh, clarity in this connection and they will be like ready to give you something or the other to make you believe that they are here to stay and they are ready to commit to you so i really feel like you know there is a uh, some sort of advancement coming with you and this person in this uh week time let's see some more cards what else can you experience coming up for you during this week let's see what else is coming in for you during this week time and then we're going to take the color cards see okay um okay i'm gonna include these cards hold on let me pick the cards up so we have just one card that fell down so we do have follow your own good advice trust yourself you know what is best for you so right now if you look within if you talk to yourself talk to yourself as if you're talking to a friend of yours and tell your story to yourself as if your friend is telling and sharing their story to you what is it that one advice that you're going to give to your person uh, your your friend uh, if they told you that they are dealing with somebody like this and you know they are upset you would tell them like fuck this person out of your life and you don't need them at all and if that's what you are you have been you know um that you would advise to your friend listen to that advice to yourself and as well and try to work on it because when you do that i really feel like you know for majority of you when you stop stressing around them that's when this person changes um you are rare and free there are not many like you so again i feel like it's time for you to own your uniqueness you know you don't have to be will be like somebody else that you're not just own your uniqueness and nobody can be you and you are going to be missed by this person and they are going to take action towards you um i feel like you know it's very important right now for you to be um more you know in, in that position where you're expecting something beautiful to happen uh rather than like you know uh feeling all oh, nothing good will ever happen to you try to manage and stay glad all the time stay positive all the time try to um try to start thinking about yourself and your life in a positive perspective perspective because that's when you're going to start attracting more abundance in your life it's very important right now for you to become stronger and when you go strong grow stronger you start looking at life from a fresher perspective as well i feel like that's what is needed on your part so you could have what you truly desire let's see the colors let's see what color could be lucky and significant for you for this week green revitalize your nervous system number 31 green color could be lucky and significant 31 could be a significant, a significant number too spending some time out in the nature is going to be beneficial for you because it's going to help you um freshen yourself up freshen your thoughts up as well so yeah that's uh, pretty much it coming up for you for this read if it was of help do like share and subscribe till i do the next read for you guys take care and if you're willing to purchase any of the services that i offer including the palm reads check the description box for that and yeah uh, till i do the next read <laughs> take care and bye Thank <clears throat> you.